hello 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 and welcome back to my channel my name is Tamil Green the digital midwife and I am enjoying sharing my Canva tips and tricks with you all today I'm going to talk about a few keyboard shortcuts that I like to use now I'm not real big on shortcuts but I know some people are and there are just a few that I like to use and Canva has a lot of keyboard shortcuts. So at the end of this video or in the description box, I will also link the um, this article right here. It shows you some other shortcuts that I will not be talking about. And that way you can kind of pick whatever ones you would like to use, okay? Okay, so all I did was just post a regular photo in here so that you're able to see the shortcuts in real time. The first trick that I like to use is just a simple getting text onto your canvas right and all you do is make sure that you have clicked on this to make sure it's active and you're just gonna press the letter T on your keyboard and voila your text area comes up okay and the reason why this is awesome is because of course you could just go over here to the text and just go you know bring one over there but if you're on another screen like photos or background or something like that um it's just simple to do that you know so just bring the t pressing just the regular t brings the text up all right so i'm just going to type in fall fall is almost here let's make it bigger so you guys can see it Okay, so now I'm going to select all of my text so that I could do a few things with it. And to select all of my text using the keyboard shortcuts, I'm just going to press Command A. All right, and if you're on a PC, I think it's just Control A, right? And so if you realize with some of the regular um, shortcuts that you probably use in Microsoft Office, some of those will also transfer into other apps such as Canva. Okay, so all I did was press Control A, and I'm going to now make it bold using Control B. Simple, right? Very quick and simple. Now, if I want to make it italicized, I just press Control, well, Command I if you're on Mac, and Control I if you're on a PC. All right. So now that's a few things to do with with text that you like. I like to do those pretty quickly and just say, you know, you finish this awesome design and now you want to, you know, add a new page. Maybe this is a book or something you're doing and you want to add a new page. If you're on a Mac, you just press com command return. And you see it just adds a new page and it doesn't bring down the rest of the text or anything like that that you might have added to it because we didn't copy duplicate the page we just added a new page okay so what what happens with canva it takes the background of whatever the previous um page is in the design okay and if you want to delete that page maybe you did it by mistake you just press command delete and it deletes it right now say you've added another element let's just put this little bird there just say you added that little bird in there and you want to duplicate it right just press command D and it duplicates it the command D function is only going to duplicate the last thing or whatever whatever is active so if you want to duplicate the text just press make sure the text is active meaning that you see that the the um, circles are highlighted it press command D and it's going to copy the text okay pretty simple right so those are all the tips I have for you as far as the Canva keyboard shortcuts if you're not into keyboard shortcuts then of course you are welcome to use your mouse and just click on the elements over there but if you're into keyboard shortcuts just make sure you look at the link below and it's going to link you to other shortcuts that are available to you and as you're designing some of these may be relevant to you and some of them may not be relevant to you so you just kind of choose which one which ones you would like to use okay thank you so much for joining me today make sure that you like comment subscribe and if you have any questions please comment them below and make sure you share it with a friend thank you for joining me